But six, the remains of Navy sailor Jacob Drake of North Lewisburg are returning home tonight. Drake was one of the sailors who lost his life after the USS John McCain and a merchant ship collided. Happening now to news reporter Ethan Fitzgerald is live in West Jefferson. Mark Brook, the escort for Jacob Drake is arriving right now. I'm going to back out here and we can watch it. They uh, just started to come up uh, now, as you can start to see it. Now, the road is closed and uh, Drake 21 was aboard the USS John McCain when it collided with a merchant ship near Singapore on August 21st. And just uh, if we stay on this picture, we'll start to see that main part of the procession here in just a couple of seconds. Uh, we'll see some family here in a couple minutes as well. And the procession starting to make their way uh, to the uh, funeral home. And if we look over here to the right, the family has been, uh, if we look over here to the right, we'll see some more of the family over here. They have been waiting in this pouring down rain. Now, just about an hour ago, he arrived at Columbus International and started making his journey here. His visitation and funeral will be Saturday. Nine other sailors were killed in that crash. The family I just talked to told me this has been an incredibly painful time for them, but they're happy to see Jacob back home. Good in a way to have him coming home and to be able to put him to rest, but at the same time, it's very heart-wrenching that he's coming home the way he is. And again, these guys are uh, all filing in here. It's a pretty large procession, but coming up tonight at 10 and 11 o'clock, I will have more uh, we'll be talking to family about just how much it means to them to have uh, their beloved Jacob Drake back home. Reporting live, Ethan Fitzgerald, two years working for you.